When you think of television production, you usually think of locations like Hollywood or Los Angeles. However, did you know that there's a small but ambitious production company right here in the city of Fontana? Lux NV Candlelight Digital TV has conducted business here for over four and a half years, producing projects all over Southern California. Their resume includes everything from music and fashion videos, drama to comedy, modeling, product promotion, and photography. What's Lux NV currently working on? Well, do you recall the old chocolate factory gag from the classic I Love Lucy show? I'm gonna shoot, I'm gonna shoot Katrina first. Get ready for the 2013 version under the direction of Lux NV founder and director Leroy Candelaria. You know, everybody loves I Love Lucy, and uh, we just kind of thought that would be a great idea. Just kind of like you know, kind of give a tribute, you know, um, and not only that, but just kind of spin it in our own way, something more modern. Modern, yes. In this version, Lucy and Ethel wear bikinis. This is an American Idol. I think we can do this. It seems easy. Not American Idol? Well, she ought to know. The young woman playing Lucy is singer, model, actress Katrina Darrell. You might remember her from a little show called American Idol. In 2009, she made quite a splash, so to speak, when she auditioned for the show in a bikini, thus gaining the title Bikini Girl. For Katrina, acting in today's video was an opportunity to promote her new business. Um, I just started my own bikini line. It's called BG Bikinis, Bikini Girl Bikinis. And I'm starting my own website, and I'm selling online. And actually. Oh, Lucy, I don't know this was such a good idea. Oh, come on, Ethel. How hard can it be? After all, who can wrap chocolates better in their bikinis than we can? So acting kind of comes naturally. And any opportunity I have to do any comedy improv, I'm all game. Working with Leroy was great. He has a great eye and a lot of you know creative ideas. And everything went really smoothly because we're friends. So we just bounced ideas and did a lot of improv. And it was a long day, but it was fun. Of course, before the fun could start, the actresses had to have the right look. That task fell to makeup artist Yenli Ross. Well, just putting the makeup on the, the transformation has just put me into character. Um, Ethel was a little challenging for me, but when she put the, the fake eyelashes on, the eyeliner, and gave it that fifty look, it just I became that character, and I started feeling like Ethel. Because <laughs> I wanted to pinch the chocolate, see what kind they were. I was the supervisor at the chocolate factory today. She's a hair and wig expert and a former professional ice skater. Today, however, Elisa Castleberry was called in to play yeah. Lucy and right. Ethel's boss. I think you have to have a little bit of a professional background to be dealing with the lights. And then our set, we took lower and the girls were sitting and I'm on my hands and knees in the background and popping up. And we did that all day long. Ricardo? Merce? Ricardo? Merce? Ricardo, Mertz, I'm your supervisor here at Bikini Factory. Your job is to take the chocolates and wrap them like this. Yes, this little video titled I Love Bikini Girl Bikinis was not without challenges for the cast and crew. You know, well, the thing with I Love Lucy, they were, they were filmed in, in a studio. You know, we're kind of working with what we have and the locations available. What was available was this home. It actually worked out just fine, as did this rather low-tech conveyor belt, contributing to some of the video's most hilarious moments. The camera's rolling. And action. Lucy, you've got some splaining to do. To see the complete and edited project, look up LuxNV.com. With the Bikini Girls, this is Glenn Ross reporting.